Uh, one thing I can guarantee is no video has gone in depth into the scientific inertia. I've gone everywhere I could with this putter. Uh, this is my extensive, exclusive review of the Lab Golf Direct Force putter. First, what are these things and what do they do? This is the uh, LAB, Lie Angle Balance Direct Force Putter. What does that even mean? Okay, what they do is they're trying to eliminate torque in your putting stroke. Torque is what you feel when you take back a conventional golf club. You feel torque. That's the twisting of the club face. This would have zero twist, zero torque, zero anything, allowing you potentially to have a much more consistent, pressure-free putting stroke than ever before. The question is, is it valuable? Does it even work? Well, I put it to the test and I'm gonna let you know for sure. So how they test the force is, I'll leave a link to the website in the video description below. They, they load this thing on what they call a revealer and it, it shows you that there's no torque when you take this back or take it through. There's no manipulating or torquing, torquing of the club face as you take it back. It, it just goes back and goes straight through. So potentially wherever you strike the ball on the club face, you would have the exact same roll because if you striked it on a, if you hit a toe strike, no torque equals, it just stays perfectly square and stable through the hitting uh, of the ball. Same with the heel. Whereas with your conventional putters, if you do a heel or toe strike, the toe would twist open or, you know, slam shot. That's torque. So their revealer, reveals all that information and uh, you could see a video on that on their website so check that out if you want more information on how that specifically works for me i wanted to know is this uh, something that uh, is going to help my game that's all we care about can i make more putts with this than my old putter and am i getting a better more consistent stroke here compared to what you are normally using. So first thing I did, I just took this to the practice green, I started rolling some putts. Put the line on the ball, roll putts, all different lengths, short, medium, long, and I will compare that to my gamer, seeing if there's something obvious that I can notice here. And it, it, it was hard, you know, you're used to your gamer putter, so putting something new in the bag usually takes some time to get used to. So immediately there, I didn't really notice a huge difference between the two other than, you know, it did feel good. It, there are certain times I pick up putters and they feel horrible and I put them away. So this didn't feel that. It felt amazingly uh, solid and pure and I loved how it looked and felt in the initial practice. Then obviously I want to get it on course and put it in action and see how I putt it was good. I couldn't say initially there was any like major improvement, but you know, I did make some decent putts with it. So that was good. Now, when I ordered this, here's what I did. I, you might wonder about the design and all this kind of stuff with this model and the others, you go and you have it specifically dialed in everything that you want, color, color of head, color of shaft, the line pattern here, I went with the, the lines here, here, and all the way back in the heel, which really helps me line up, uh, even from the back end, helps getting that uh, putter face square for me. Uh, this last line really helps. So like you specifically do everything, including your lie angle, there's ways to do it. So all the directions are on the site, but 
length, lie angle, putter, head, a couple different options, and then all the custom designs on there you pick out. Then, what I wanted to do, I wanted to go even deeper and deeper and see, okay, what's the science telling me with this putter compared to my Scotty Cameron normal gamer? So I took it into the Sam Putting Lab. So my friend Mitch at White Columns Country Club, he's one of the pros there. He's a putting expert and put this and the Scotty Cameron both onto the, the Sam computer and got stats from that to see, hey, which one is rolling better? Whew. So these are the results from that. With my Scotty Cameron, super consistent. It's doing everything that I would want, getting a great roll, good um, swing arm, good patterns, everything looking really good there. So then we put this on there. Now, the roll, the tempo timing is fantastic. Uh, I was making the same amount of putts, you know, in studio with this as with my putter. The only thing was, for me, I was getting a technically better roll with my Scotty Cameron than with this, a better stroke, okay? A little bit better stroke. And the reason we thought was because of the grip that we had on uh, here, I had that larger, that really large grip. So what I did was I came here and then I swapped out the grip and then I went with the smaller uh, forward press version of the grip here. So I put this on and now that this is on, this feels so much better and I feel the head so much more and then just hitting a few rolls in here getting a much even better strike than I was before. So here's what I would say. If you struggle and you're looking for more consistency, and especially when you get under pressure, if you need some help with that, I would definitely look into the lab direct force putters. And if you struggle hitting the ball center of the club face every time, this is the best off center uh, putter I've ever used. So I would say if you struggle with consistency, great way to go. The ball rolls great. The feel is phenomenal. And I do love the uh, alignment aids on that. I know other putters do stuff like that, but this really helps having this back line because if I, let's say you put a line on the ball and then you line the back line up to it, it really squares that face up without you having to square the face up, right? You're just lining the back up and the face gets immediately perfectly square to your target line. It looks weird, yes, and it takes some time to get used to, but once you do, you're gonna have some great success. So they're expensive, they're not cheap. There's a link in the video description below. I would say check it out, watch their videos, see if it's something that would, uh, you know, benefit you. And if so, take the time and uh, get your own personalized custom fit Direct Force putter. They feel amazing. Direct Force, lab putter, thumbs up in my book. You're gonna see it a lot more in my bag. Thanks for watching. Love you guys. Good luck out there.